30 operational vehicles and over 1,000 motorcycles have been procured by the Benue State Government to be distributed to members of the State Volunteer Guards and Ward Heads. The move by the Benue State Government is to help secure rural communities from persistent attacks. Governor Samuel Otom formally inaugurates the vehicles and motorcycles to the admiration of the beneficiaries. <laughs> Governor Otom, who is a victim of a recent attack on his farm, rescinds the practice of compensating herders who lost their cattle during rustling or impoundment. Do ranching. But if you think you are above the law, the commissioner of police is there, the security agencies are there to apprehend you. And of course, our lifestyle guards and our community volunteer guards are there to enforce the laws of our land. But if anything happened to you and your livestock, don't come and complain and say that government will pay. Government should pay you compensation. I will not do that. The idea of presenting the vehicles to security operatives and traditional rulers is to improve local intelligence gathering and surveillance and ultimately curtail attacks on rural communities. What is happening now, the Toti is so worried. There is no day the headsmen don't pass through Nasarawa to Benue. They come and meet in the night, and even today, they kill in, 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 in Kaduku. And they do this in the night, they go and get the woman that maybe have gone to the what to fetch water. They are doing this on a daily basis. For effective service delivery at the domain of these traditional rulers, we believe that these bikes uh, will really enhance them. We will really add to what they have been doing. These are traditional rulers that are very close to the people. We are talking about 276 traditional rulers. Those are the number of words that we have uh, in Benue State. This move by the state government is aimed at adding value to the level of community protection that will enable displaced persons access to their ancestral homes.